art market and cookout. Uh, so, we had, uh, so my idea was to have artists come in, local artists. Are, uh, there's uh, uh, all sorts of types of artists, like uh, screen printers, like uh, DIY stuff, graffiti artists, uh, sculptors, painters. So this is just a chance for people to sell work. And this, I just wanted to create something for people to sell their work and eat food and enjoy the day. Where are you at? What? Where are you at? I'm at La Katrina Cafe in Costa. Um, yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm not a very good interviewer. My name is Sal Vega, this is I'm born and raised in this community. I went to uh, uh, Youngman School, uh, Province of Garden, Kindergarten. As a little boy, I went to Casa Slan at five years old. When I first entered that building, it was run by young uh, white ladies that were teaching people how to cook and other activities. And since then, I've been always in and out of that building. But because this is my neighborhood, this is, it's been a while, I haven't painted a painting because that was one of the things that got me started to do what I do. Um, this is something that I'm doing uh, uh, with in conjunction with the owner of the building, which, which is also named Sal. And this is the this cafeteria is named La Catrina. Something that we're, 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 uh, we identify with La Muerte. Because of the, the subject matter, because it is an, a mystery or something that, uh, that happens that's very either tragic or uh, is a blessing. Now the door is an entry to this, what I, which I call is the twilight. The twilight is this, when we're born, we're also born into, what? We will die. La muerte nos va catch us. There are two, two words, or a couple words that are going to be painted in on the walls called saying, I'm going to get you, or te voy a agarrar, which we all can relate, you know, is, but the, 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 the other thing is, is, is it, the, 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 the entry is, is this, it's a twilight, or life and death, right? There's a left and a right, or there's a man and a woman, there's a fine line that finds what it is, who we are. Now, there's a, a the, the black and white thing is something to do with, the, it's a ripple, it's a intensity, it says we all carry these intensities of experiences, and that's what that is for me, my experience. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> well, when I first seen my first murals, there was an artist there that started this sort of movement in our community, uh, Ray Patlan, Marco Raya, and others, which were, were identifying with our Mexican identity, our culture, which I appreciate or identify with. Gasaslan had this movement with the brown berets, you know, we are our, our community. Mexicanos, and to this day, so now there's this thing happening now that's in all these years I haven't been back that uh, the, the building's gonna be slipping through our fingers to our community. Well, times change, you know, so just like when uh, we were a threat to somebody else that was in this neighborhood, now they're a threat to us. Things change. And that's why I'm 